I had a company reach out to me and ask me if I could use a digital microscope. Uh, I've seen a lot of other YouTubers that are, when they're sharpening tools, they use them. I thought, you know, this might be a good thing for the shop. So let me see if I can figure out how to put this thing together and we'll see how it goes from there. We are recording. Alright, so do I really need an electron microscope? Well, I have this card here. This comes out of one of those Mule automatic gate systems. This is a $300 card. I looked online and it's just a couple of relays that are about a dollar and a half if you can get them unsoldered. Well, let me see here what we got. So I just rotate this down and now we are looking at these two little resistors right here so you can barely see you know they're as big as the tip and then that is not as close as it goes if i want to i've got a digital zoom i can sit here and zoom in way closer to what i need to uh, if i want to i can also bring this down closer to my work and that will also zoom it in so by lowering the rod this has to be within three inches as a, the focal point but then you can bring this down however I think that it'd be nice to have room underneath to work with but man the picture quality on this is just absolutely superb it's also able to be connected to your computer it's got HDMI outputs we can uh, take pictures it's got it came with a 32 gig SD card I can actually take picture if I want to I just snapped a picture of that and I can upload that let's see if we were I've been sitting here sharpening some chisels and if I want to see how good of a point that I got you know on the edge of this chisel we can certainly see that this is you know pretty good but right there at that edge missed just a little bit so I mean there's definitely um, I mean this has been sand, uh, ground down to 6,000 and under this microscope that still looks pretty rough but I know that that's uh, already down to 6,000 grit uh, stone on this see what let's see what else we can get so this really isn't necessarily a shop thing but if you got kids or something this little thing is pretty cool so let me uh, see if i can get a little blood here oh i'm glad i don't have to do that every day so if you do um go for you there so let's uh put a little blood on there and a little piece of so let's see what this thing looks like under this little I can find it, huh? <laughs> so that is pretty dang um, uh, cool, I think, here. So this little microscope is uh, just going to be awesome. Um, you know, right here for me to be able to replace uh, stuff on this PCB board is just going to be fantastic. It's got the power supply that runs the monitor also runs these little lights down here. Now, that same one just unplugs from the lights and plugs into the micro um, slide, you know, the backlight for the slide. So if you're wanting the slides this thing magnifies up to 2080 times now you're four to five millimeters from it for me what i would be using is this is their smallest lens it only magnifies 60 to 300 times which is what i would probably be using the most often it also comes with a third lens that uh, does 18 to 720 times so it has a uh, about a half inch to a three inch uh, focal length so that you still have a little bit of room you can get up under there working on something um, like I said this one is uh, four to five millimeters so that's less than a quarter inch focal length but this is where you're looking at your specimens 
it came with a bunch of slides. It's got uh, the slide holders that you can put right down to the board. It's got tie downs. It came with a whole assortment of different slides that you can check out. Um, basically everything you need. It's got the HDMI cables if you want to hook this up to a larger monitor. Uh, you want to hook it up to your computer or recording. It had a 32 gig card that came with it where you can take pictures, videos. I think it's showing like five hours and six minutes worth of video that you can record. So if you're trying to record stuff, uh, great uh, uh, a little tool to have in the shop. Uh, you know, I'm super glad that they sent this out to me. I've been putting it off. I should have reviewed this a long time ago because I wasn't for sure just uh, how useful this is going to be. But after getting this out, this is really something that I can see, especially with the electronics, will be a great asset to have. So until next time, thanks for watching.